Good Midwest morning, everyone. This is Nicole, your mobile bloggers for TOCtown.com. And today I am working on the studio and we're on the express. How do you like our new wreath by Pastor Carmen by Carmen's Handmade Design? I just gave her a couple of details and she just went for it. Welcome back to my channel, everyone. Today is Director's Desktop, where I share with you a more in-depth look at what's going on in the studio, as well as my personal perspective as now a director. And this is what I wanted to share with you, uh, slowing it down a little bit and doing an unboxing from another small business owner getting set up locally here in Chicago. The reason I really like supporting her business is a portion of her proceeds goes to help support a lot of the restoration going on in Puerto Rico post Hurricane Maria. For Small Business Saturday. So she designed a wreath for the studio, which we're going to start decorating for the holiday. and. I shared I wanted to take you along with me. So before my camera runs out of battery power and I have to plug her back in, let me do an unboxing for you. And she said it was too huge to fit on the desk. <laughs> so I mean on the cabinet um, shelf. So dun, 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 dun. let's see what it looks like. Okay, um, I decided to put it in a better spot that was lit. This is hopefully the nail it's gonna go on on the wall. And I love it. Oh my goodness. She included some little extras, Lady Nicole for TOCtown.com. Thanks, Pastor Carmen. Oh my goodness. So either we can hang this up here and whoever is blogging for the blogosphere can hang their nameplate as well. Oh my goodness. Okay, okay, okay. Now next, I'm going to see how the wreath looks. Let's see. Okay. All right. Let me show you. It's out of the box now. Flowers are a huge island design, which I adore. Let's see if she hangs. And she does. Perfect. Okay, let me step back. This is as far out as it'll go. So let me try to get it from a lighter angle so that it will be brighter. This is all the behind the scenes stuff you have to work through in order to get a perfect backdrop or at least a workable scene. So this is going to be the Blogosphere Island Wreath <laughs> for 2019. I hope you like it. Leave a comment in the section below if you think we should add a few things to it. We are. So just to show you the first unveiling of our 2019 studio design. Alrighty, 2019 design is underway. Stay tuned. Okay, no, I'm not just <laughs> pointing out my earrings, but I wanted to make sure I captured a couple of the topics that I'll be covering in 2019. As I celebrate my 50th birthday, I want to take you through some of the changes that I'm going to be doing 
as far as production wardrobe is concerned. And also, my TN station is going to be transported to a new area. And I use the Kindle Fire as well as my AT&T phone when I'm working on the Express. Pretty much, I wanted to film this portion to share with you, like, <laughs> things don't happen, you know, overnight. Oh, I'm holding my Canon Vixa, which definitely is a high-quality camera, well worth the investment. Of course, I'll list any of the materials and all of the resources that I have on my TN station, as well as in my retreat center for our artisan admins. So when you want to start producing your videos, you pretty much have an idea of different ways you can use your traveler's notebooks as well as your planners. And best of all, how to position your digital devices so they function better for you. There are so many apps that are native to the device that you can use without purchasing, you know, extra items. Or if you need to purchase like simple apps, it's possible, you know, with a few dollars. I'll even do a less than $100 studio design later on this week. I'm Nicole, your mobile blog is for TOCtown.com. I'm on the Express. Take care.